Hey everybody, Mobile Mike here from thegadgetgurus.net. Just wanted to give you a quick walkthrough of the new Amazon video for Xbox 360. Um, it's basically the same kind of UI that you would expect from the other apps, uh, Netflix and Hulu and all that. But um, you basically go to, if you haven't downloaded it, you scroll to your app section and it should show up here and ask you to, uh, to download it and log in. So I've already downloaded, already logged in, so let's take a look at the... Uh, the UI here. It's very much uh, similar to all the other Xbox 360 video apps, you know, where it has the kind of side scrolling and the uh, and the square interface. Um, but if you are an Amazon Prime member, you'll be able to stream all of the Prime videos, kind of very much like Netflix if you're a Netflix subscriber. Um, but if you've purchased any videos, uh, like movies, TV shows, or anything like that, on uh, Amazon, it's also going to show up when you log in as well. So, it uh, looks like they're they're bringing the uh, the competition uh, a little bit more so to uh, to Apple with this because now you'll be able to easily get uh, your movies and whatnot. So you've got your home, um, you've got uh, search, of course, Prime movies, which would be uh, movies that you could stream from Prime, Prime TV shows again things that you can stream from Prime, uh, help, and your settings. Uh, I don't have a Kinect, so I haven't messed around with the Kinect tuner, but uh, that's in there if you do. Um, so if you go to home here, you can go to your watch list, which is basically like a playlist, or you've got your video library, and then this is going to show you all of, you know, all of your videos that you have. Anything that's in HD, obviously will be labeled as HD. Um, you can hit the Y button and search. So if you have a large library, you can make it a little bit easier to find stuff. Um, luckily, I don't have a very big library. Um, if you want to purchase something, you can do it from here as well. Uh, or I'm sorry, not purchase, but stream something. Um, like if we wanted to, I don't have Prime, so it probably won't stream. So let me show you one of my videos. Uh, we'll load up the Avengers. And then so you, you can add um, the, uh, oh, that's weird. This is the first time I've run into this right here. This video will be available for Xbox 360 soon. So I guess not every video that you have is going to be uh, available. That's, that's kind of su that kind of sucks. Um, this is the video I tested yesterday, and it worked. So I guess not all, maybe some of the newer Episodes aren't going to be available yet. Let's go here. This is episode six. Yeah, wow. That's uh, that's not cool. Amazon. What the hell? Yeah, wow. All right. Well, um, yeah, this kind of sucks. <laughs> so let me show you what it looks like for one of the videos that is actually available. Uh, let me go ahead and watch now. And it's very similar to Netflix if you've ever used Netflix or uh, or the Zoom video on Xbox. So it's not not a huge change in UI. On Avengers. You've got your pop-up your controls time, here. There's your different display modes. Letterbox. Full screen stretch. Uh, Fast forward. Play. Iron Man, and so I'm explaining the Thor, Beast, the Asgard, yeah. and um, so that's kind of the run-through right there. Uh, I just want to check and see if any of my other movies that I like, the actual movies that I have, aren't on here, uh, aren't available. So I, I guess they're gonna add those to 360 as time goes on. Maybe they, it's a different, um, yeah, resume viewing. So this is. Maybe it's just they don't have everything added to the specific server or, or a playlist. So it's not all on here yet. Yeah, I can watch this now. So, huh. Maybe Amazon just doesn't like the Avengers. I don't know. But, oh, no. oh nope. Terminator 2 is not available either. So I guess it's just going to take them time to get everything available on the Xbox. So uh, that's, that's really the only downside that I just now found. So... Um, this is an overview of Amazon Video on the Xbox 360. Uh, you can check out thegadgetgurus.net for the podcast and all the other fun stuff that we do. Thanks for watching, guys.